today in our motorhome, we're going to be taking a look at and changing the connector. We're going to be using the Hopkins Endurance Connector, part number HM48480. As you can see, it's got a rather substantial pivot point at the top. It's going to make it real strong and it's going to last a long time. We're going to start with our power wire. And we're going to attach that to the auxiliary side of our wiring. It's going to loosen it up. Then we'll take our wire, slip it in between, and we'll tighten it back down. You want to pay attention not to have any any stray wire sticking out that could come in contact with another connector. Now we'll do our tail lights. Take our brown wire, twist it, slip it into place. You want to be sure to test all your wiring to make sure that they are the same colors as we're using here because some vehicles are wired differently. So best to take your test light and just test all the wires. Do our left turn. Do our ground. We'll do our right turn. Now there is a provision for a trailer brake, which our vehicle does not have. So once you have all those attached, we're going to take some of the supplied dielectric grease and we're going to apply some to the inside here just to cut down on corrosion. Then we'll take our cover. You want to place the, the screw side down. Snap it into place and you'll hear it lock. And take our wires, push them back up there, and we'll tighten up our set screw. That's going to hold our wiring in place. You just need a little bit of tension on it. You don't have to get too crazy and tighten it up. I'm going to take a little bit of electrical tape. And we'll go around the outside. Keep it all sealed up. Now you can take some of your dielectric also and put it on the inside of your connections to help with any kind of corrosion on the inside. Now that we have the wiring done, we're going to mount a supplied bracket. It does come with two supplied holes in the bracket. We've decided to mount ours to an existing bracket, so we just simply drilled another hole. And we're going to use the two, the one we drilled and the one of the original ones, and attach it to that. There is a split in the middle of the bracket here, so you just fold it a little bit. And you can slip your wiring right through it. Then we'll put our supplied bolts. As you can see, the bolt fits into that housing. And we're going to put a flat washer, our lock washer, and a nut. And we'll install them in all four of the holes. Now we can take our wrench and tighten them up. Now we'll tie up our loose wires and we'll test our plug. So our tail lights, okay, left turn, right turn, and our brake signal. It's a solid on both sides. There we go. It all works. We're ready to plug in our trailer and hit the road. And that's going to do it for our look at and install of the Hopkins Endurance Professional Grade Trailer Connector part number HM48480.